While you were enjoying spring break, Dr. Shanoff and district leaders were searching for talented teachers to join the SDOC family. We started on one side of the island and then moved across to the other side of the island and we were able to meet many, many educators throughout Puerto Rico that were interested in potentially relocating to Osceola County. Out of 100 scheduled interviews, 23 were hired on the spot, including Talisha Rivera. Osceola, it's a wonderful place to work and to be part of something bigger than myself. Mrs. Rivera knows Osceola well, having worked as a teacher at Highlands Elementary during the 2022-2023 school year. I have to move to Puerto Rico because some family uh, affairs that I, you know, to take care of. With those resolved, she's ready to come back as a third grade teacher for the brand new Knights Point K-8 school. This means the work to me because it means that I'm going to have the support and resources that I need, you know, to help uh, my student growth and success. Our district is always recruiting, but now is the prime time to attract certified teachers in Puerto Rico who meet the state of Florida's certification requirements. There's enough time for them to figure out what they're going to do as far as their housing situations. Diana Martinez has been in constant communication with Mrs. Rivera and the other candidates she met during the trip to share relocation resources. She's supporting me and everybody else, you know, in this process, every step of the way. So I feel very comfortable and ready. <laughs> this won't be the last time Dr. Shanoff visits Puerto Rico. The idea that we have now matched in advance a new teacher with a group of students, that is the most exciting part.